say there's a new season and there's a new ingredient that you're excited about, what is the process as the executive chef with your entire team? Because you manage a staff of what, 40 people? Yeah, there's plus about, or minus, there's about 40 that. people, you know, some are working for the catering department, mm -hmm. some are working for the private dining room department, and yeah. some are working for the for Restaurant Daniel. Mm -hmm. So at Restaurant Daniel, we have uh, Edito, uh, which is the chef de cuisine, and a couple of sous chefs, you know, in charge of fish, meat, and, and uh, other section. Mm -hmm. uh, we kind of sit down together, talk about the menu. Eddie brings some ideas, I bring some ideas, Daniel brings some ideas, you know. Uh, we work on it, you know, um, to make some tests. Uh, see, uh, when, we, when we make the meeting, we kind of uh, see um, what ingredients we're going to use in each dish. Uh -huh. uh, because uh, let's say, you know, the vegetable basket in spring is uh, these 25 ingredients. We try not to use it in different dishes. Right. Uh, so for the customer, it's, uh, uh, it's easier to choose on the menu if, not, you know, everything is different, you know. Uh, and then after we see what kind of protein we're gonna marry marry with it, yeah. or if it's gonna be a vegetarian dish, and see what will bring you know the enhance the flavor in it. You know, it could be a fresh herb, it could be a spice, it could be also like something you know like a citrus, something very acidic, you know, mm -hmm. and something create the contrast. And then uh, we go from there, you know. And in the same time, when we try to balance the menu, so we have some uh, dishes we may be more finished by the waiters like a, d done like a flambe table side or a carving or something like that mm -hmm. and then we have other dishes who are completely done in the kitchen and also we balance the menu away and certain dishes are more about preparation you know right. and it's very easy for service and so other dishes are not as uh, much preparation ahead of time but then mm -hmm. service time you know it's a bit more complicated so we need to have right. a balance in all those uh, areas. area you know yeah. so during service you have a better uh, uh, transition, you know, it's, it's a bit more smooth, you know. That makes sense, yeah, just to be able to, it's, you're like the director, the composer, right? You have to understand all Yeah, that, you know, but it takes a lot together. of people, you know, to put it together, you right. know, and it's, it's really a teamwork, you know, and uh, I think, you know, during service is the same, you know, it goes from the, uh, the dishwasher to the person using the canapé to uh, the last uh, person signing the dessert, you know, I mean, everybody has to be focused on a, on a job and, and make the best out of it. Right. And uh, that's what creates the uh, whole experience. And of yeah. course, you know, don't, we cannot forget the front of the house as well, you know. Of course. Because they're the yes. one, you know, with the first and the last um, impression, contact and impression yes. to the customer, you know. So. Definitely. Definitely.